Hello and welcome. Today I'm going to show you how to offload your levator scapulae muscle, the muscle that runs from the top of your spine down towards your scapular bone. We're going to use the colorful stretchy K-tape. We're going to use this to offload this muscle when it's working too hard. Often when you sit at desk for long hours and you develop a poking chin posture, this muscle gets put on a lot of tension and can either cause neck pain right along the side of your neck or often people will complain about pain at the point of their scapula there. The levator scapulae muscle is often responsible for this and we just want to be able to take some of the load or some of the force off of this muscle with the strapping technique that I'm going to show you. If you're wondering how to apply the taping, please go and look at one of our previous videos which just explains the basics about tape application, simple concepts such as trimming the corners off the edges to help it to stick better, how to clean the skin before you put the taping on, and how to use adhesive sprays that just help the tape to stick a little bit better. To strap this muscle, you're going to ask the patient to tilt their head to the side and forward in that position. You'll see their skin stretching as they move into that direction, you know you've got that muscle nicely on a stretch. You're going to apply it from the top, almost at the base of their skull where their hairline is, down towards the inside of their scapular bone. You'll often see that little triangle. That's where you want the tape to end. You're going to cut that length. Remember to cut the corners off the tape to keep it sticking properly. You're going to tear two bases at either side of the tape. Apply the one base with no tension at the top next to the center of their spine, just under their hairline. You're going to run the tape down towards that bony prominence we were talking about of your scapula. Rub the tape to make sure it's sticking properly the whole way down. And then you're going to lay the base of the tape down with no tension. As the patient lifts their head, you'll see some crinkles form over there. This just shows you that you stuck the tape down correctly. this video please don't forget to hit the like button and consider subscribing to our channel you'll find lots of other strapping videos just like this one for different injuries and conditions you can see some of the links that I've attached here please go and have a look at them we're going to be continuing this series for another 10 or so videos and I would love for you to join me